you were instructed to go into the pot. You were not instructed to begin your search. Unfreeze. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Guys, today was the Indomie tax. Like, the housemates have made, they made some millions and I'm really happy for them. But I'm going to run you guys through on how the whole thing went. Actually, Big Brother, Big Brother actually sent a brief to them and also read house, the head of house also. He read the brief to them and the house was divided into seven pair like a pair of two and the pairs were um, divided in this format like Watoni was with Kidwire, Neo and Erica, Lucy and Ozo, Prince and Nengi, Dorothy and Lekon, Tricky T and Tolani Badge and then V and Brighto. All of them were in this group in twos like that, two, 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 a boy and a girl, a boy and a girl and all that. And then the next step was for them to go to get, get to the arena and there was something like a pool full of balloon and they were dummy ingredients like chicken, green bell pepper, yellow pepper, corn and all that. And then it, Kid Brother was saying that at the sound of the buzzer rather, they should get into that pool like something and search for their ingredients as in housemates are supposed to search for five ideal cooking ingredients that they will use to make their indomie that represents their culture or something of sorts you understand and then they went into the pool the pool of balloon i don't know that's what i call it you get but there's a name for it the pool of balloon and they started searching for their five ideal ingredients now <laughs> Housemates, freeze. At the end of the search, they got it and then they went into the into the house after the whole housemate they found their stuffs and then it was time for them to cook they were given 30 minutes for each pair to actually cook their meals like i will tell you about my culture and how we do the things and then you cook something that represents my culture it's big brother you have 10 minutes to complete your task it's not fine i'll go now i want to okay. help you can i help you Kidwire and Watoni, they, they made their food and then Kidwire actually scored Watoni and Watoni actually scored um, Kidwire. And then the whole tricks of this thing was that if whatever you score your partner, if you score, for instance, now if you score your partner 7 and then you, your partner scores you 10, at the end of the day, when it is time for the prize, you get the the seven you scored your partner and then your partner gets the ten you scored him or her you get because that's the trick that big brother actually used they actually did not know this fact was was mentioned to them at the end when the prize was about to be given to them and then it started from kid wire and watoni doing their presentation a personal favorite of mine and that we eat a lot is called pocho Pocho soup, um, actually, uh, it's very hard to explain, but all I can tell you is very, very tasty. So if you ever get a chance to go to Benway, please look out for Pocho soup. Um, we're, we're a city that loves to, a state that loves to eat pork as well. Um, we love for our friends. After Kidwire and Watoni finished doing their presentation, it was time for Neil and Erica. Neil and Erica, they did theirs and... To so some reason, they all spoke about how they, about their culture, what their culture is about, the food they eat, the kind of things they do, and just like explaining in total what their culture is. Urubu Wado. Urubu Wado. My name is Akpofre Emubo Nuvie Neo Olise. I'm from Delta State, Nigeria, Ethiopia's East local government. Of Delta State. They're moving on. The next set was Lucy and Ozo. Lucy and Ozo, they also did their presentation. Lucy is from Calabar and Ozo is an Igbo guy. He just spoke about their tribe and both of them just spoke about their tribe individually. So, typically, this is an epic bride. The queen also dresses this way, but usually she has a crown, not just this hair. And usually, this hair, the length of the back one, Depends on your position as the daughter. If you're the first daughter, it gets here. Yeah, if you're the second daughter and above, it gets shorter. Okay? So, 
we call this Esali. And then the next people that did theirs was Prince and Nengi. The ne and they talked about um Prince is Igbo, Nengi is from Bayelsa State. They both talked about their culture. They both did a presentation on what their food stands for, their culture. And <laughs> That means that my name is Prince Oye de Kachi and Warami. I'm from the Igbo land. The next set of people also was Dorothy and Lekon. You get Dorothy and Lekon, they came, they did their presentation, they had their fun, they talked about their tribes, they talked about their food. We are known for Owambe, we are known for uh, lots of jolly, jolly, jolly times, and uh, we are very, very good people with um, welcoming spirit and we are morally inclined in everything that we do. Um, one of the most popular presidents or rulers of Nigeria, who was um, Chief Oluchegu Obasanjo, he was a former president of Nigeria, so a former head of state of Nigeria. That and then Trikiti and Tolani Baj, they did the same thing, talked about their culture, their food and also... Ah, uh, Jean, yeah. The Isom people, as you know, can be found in riverine areas. That is, we like the water. You can say that we and water are one. So whether it is salt water or fresh water, trust me, you will find Isom men. And then the last set that came with V. V and Brito. V and Brito actually came and they talked about their food, they talked about um, their culture and in total to Tasha they did some presentation and talked about it and much later they actually went into the, the house back after the whole presentation and then much later Big Brother actually called them back into the arena to actually tell them to tell them the prize they have won and then at the end of the day the house won a total of 4 million naira as in for all of them, the four million naira for all of them, and then five hundred and seventy-one thousand naira for one pair, as in a pair of two people get five hundred and seventy-one thousand naira. And then in that five hundred and seventy-one thousand, if you had scored me, for instance, if you had scored me seven, and then you scored yourself, I scored you ten. It therefore means that the ten I scored you is for me. The seven you scored me is for you. And then they share the money according to the score. So it's not like as we both end our, as we both um actually won 551,000 naira that we are supposed to share it 50 50 that's not how the game was played it was played according to the score you actually gave your partner and i'm sure that each time each and every time if big brother actually comes to give them something that will just make them in a way they are not suspicious of because if everybody had known they would have just kept kept scoring themselves 10 over 10 10 over 10 knowing that at the end of the day they are going to share the money equally so a few of the housemates actually did not score themselves 10 over 10 the likes of um, watoni and them um, um kid wire kid wire actually scored watoni 10 and uh, 7 Kid Wire scored Watoni 7 and Watoni scored Kid Wire 10, which made Watoni's money bigger than Kid Wire's own. And then Nengi actually scored Prince 9 and Prince scored Nengi 10. That means Nengi gets a lower part of the money. And then also V and Brito. V actually scored Brito 7 and Brito scored V 6. That means V's money will be higher than that of Brito's and that, and that was how it was. Not like the whole housemate got the money equally shared across them, but it was shared according to the score you actually gave your partner. So that's basically how the Indomie tax actually came and I'm sure all of them they are happy because even myself that is talking this and doing this, oh god I wish I was there, I wish I was one of the housemates to win this money because the least person won 200 and something thousand naira in this particular tax and I'm sure they are happy about it because even me I'm happy for them. Nobody that is not happy when they have money. You get so that's just basically that just said i should come and give you guys the quick update on how the tax actually went i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up leave me a comment in the comment section and please if you have not subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for mbog now be quiet joe Pele. sorry if i've offended you oh yeah sorry i'll not talk too much again subscribe to the channel and turn on your notification bell so that youtube will inform you whenever i post a new video as you can see guys i'm rushing because i have a lot of things to attend to but i just felt like let me update you guys so that you guys will not be slacking Stay safe and stay out of trouble. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.